Got a news alert for you. There's a new report showing that nearly 20,000 illegal immigrant criminals were freed back into the U.S. streets last year. Joining me now to discuss Jan Morgan and Eric Guster. Eric, I got to ask you, how does Donald, I mean, Barack Obama justify this? <laughs> how does Donald Trump justify this? I don't know. No, um, uh, well, there are rules in place in order to deport people, and he was following the rules. They weren't deported, though. They're just I know, allowed back I know. in American And that's what I'm saying. They were, they were released, they did their time, and they were released back in society, just like anyone else has a right to do their time and release back illegal, in society. How, the, how come illegal immigrants, how can were, illegal immigrants have the same rights? Yeah, yeah. 12,000 traffic But what about the guys who committed felonies? Come on, Eric, why should they be allowed back on American streets? I mean, but some of these felonies are really low-level felonies, Charles. You're talking about little theft I'm cases, talking about assault burglaries. cases. Are, you're not going to sit there and, and tell those, me that, that people who were arrested for assault, people who were arrested for robbery, that that's okay, they, they, they came here illegally, they committed a crime in this country, and that, you know what, go ahead, go back on the street. There are certain rules to deport people. There are certain rules to allow them to come back. These people did their time. They have every right to come back and do not be deported, to be released back in society after they do their time. And let's look at the real facts. 12,000 were traffic offenses. That's super minor if any other offenses is regarded. You know, what I found interesting, Jan, there were only 3,000 who had a rap sheet for immigration. I figured if you're illegal, uh, that should be the first thing you got arrested for. But right. tell me how screwy this thing is. This is really nuts that someone could come here illegally, commit a crime, and then walk the streets of America. How much time we got, Charles? One minute uh, you and know, 50 I, seconds. I tell you what, we kept talking about the rules and rules. This is an Obama administration issue, not an ICE issue. The Border Patrol agents are doing the very best that they can. In fact, that's why the Border Patrol Council has endorsed Donald Trump, because they know he's going to build a wall, and he's going to get rid of these people and keep them out of here. But let me tell you this. If our federal government spent as much time and energy tracking down and incarcerating than deporting these illegal aliens as they do tracking down, incarcerating, law-abiding American citizen cattle ranchers, over land rights, we wouldn't be talking about this issue today. Eric, you got to admit this. Just not. It's just something really bad about this, my man. Did she just bring up the cattle rights? The guys who were millionaires who were trying mm -hmm. to graze cattle for free. Uh, that now that is someone who's really taking advantage of the government. If you ever want to use. But them illegal now. immigrants. Do you think that that it's right for them who, to commit a crime and stay in this country? Uh, if they do their time, they do have the right. Why? If you come here <laughs> illegally, how come you have a right to stay? Well. In certain cases, they have to be deported. But if a person does something, they do their time. And a lot of those offenses were so minor, Charles. You're talking about traffic the, the offenses. First offense and that's what we're doing. Oh, 20,000 offenses. The first, but they were 15,000 were traffic. The coming into the country illegally. I don't care. Everyone, Anything after that is every, gravy. Hey, if you come here illegally, you've committed a, a crime. But that's why, that's why we're trying to work out the immigration system to make it a lot more beneficial for people who want to be here because this country was built upon immigrants right and for, not, it's very unfair for us to tell people right. you can't come guys we got to leave it there because